Today we're going to have a look at how we can generate new asset entries inside of Toon Boom Producer using a CSV file. To do so, we're going to go to Assets, Manage, and this is the page where you can have a look at all the assets that you are busy tracking, as well as set up some approvals and assign different stages. Let's have a look at how we can import from here using the more button and going to import CSV. In here, we have two options. We can either select a CSV file that we have previously prepared, or we can also go directly from a spreadsheet, copy and paste the columns and the information in here. Let's have a look at importing a CSV file. So I'm going to click on select the CSV file. And this is the one that I've pre-prepared called import asset CSV. Click open. All the other information here should be fine. So I'm just going to click on next data mapping. And we can just check if the mapping is correct, which it looks like everything is fine. And we're going to, again, click on Next, Verify. At the bottom here, you can see that um, 26 new entries will be created, and there are zero errors. So we can get going next, Import. It'll take a second. And once it's complete, we click on close. Now, right at the bottom of this list, we should see all the new entries that we've just created. And you'll even notice that we've got two types here of assets, backgrounds and characters. And that because we've specified the workflow that we would like to be used for each asset, producer has correctly imported the background and associated the correct workflow for backgrounds and characters, the correct workflow for characters, as well as the categories, some being backgrounds and others being main characters or incidental characters, as well as props at the bottom here.